Police are on the hunt for a donation jar thief in Pontiac, but it's where he hid the jar and what he was holding that makes this so very strange. Jason Colthorpe obtained the very revealing surveillance video. It wasn't the first time this guy had walked into the 7-Eleven. When he came in, staff knew exactly who he was, but on this occasion, he was a lot more brazen, stealing, and all the while knowing he was on tape. He's a low life. Hard to disagree when you see what this limping larcenist did Monday evening. First, he swipes a lighter. Then, other side of the store, he snags something else, maybe some honey buns. It looked like he was casing out the store, looking for opportunity, what he could take, you know, looking for the employees to be distracted. Then he goes in for the big prize, a donation jar full of money, and he shoves it in his pants. The donations were for the funeral of this little girl, baby Isabella Cooper, who died unexpectedly. Her mother is a good customer here. But she's a regular customer in here. I mean, she's very good. I mean, I had no problem helping her out. The jars have been spotted around town, but so far this crook on crutches has not, having made his slow getaway before police arrived Monday night. While the jar is gone, the need for this family still exists. They're now holding fundraisers. We have all that information. If you click on this story, on clickondetroit.com. In Pontiac, Jason Coulthorpe, Local 4.